Welcome to Astro Design at CES 2018, and we're part of the HDMI booth this year. Um, we are showcasing our video signal generator and our HDMI protocol analyzer. Astro Design is famous for a lot of its very stable, robust video uh, test, test and measurement equipment. And we also make a lot of video equipment with high-speed signals like our 8K camera because we've been working in the industry with companies like NHK for several years now. So what is this machine there? So this is our video signal generator. You can upload various uh, custom timings, patterns, any picture you want, any timing you want. And we send them out by modules like HDMI, DisplayPort, um, to the various standards. So there's a bunch of uh, connectors in the back? Yes. And one of our new things is our 12G SDI generator. And there really aren't a lot on the market right now. So we provide a very stable 12G generator signal. So the companies that make uh, TVs or other cameras or set-top box or something, they, yes. they, they would you, use this to test? Before. Yes, this is very useful for testing displays. And any major company that makes displays that you might see at CES is really using our equipment. Um, one of those reasons is that 8K displays is really big right now, but we are actually the only way to get a pure 8K 120 uh, 444 signal out on uh, for testing right now. And it's, 444. Yeah, uh, that's RGB color. Yeah. 10 and, bit. Um, yeah, various yeah. like 10 bit, 12 bit, and it's by synchronizing four of our generators together. How do they synchronize? So we have a synchronization module that we developed to test for 8K and um, you would still be able to do it through things like HDMI. What is the software that you run in here? Is it Linux based? We make our own software. I think it's Windows based, not Linux, but uh, it's a... Uh, so all the, there, are, there are all the different resolutions, frame rates, yes. and all that stuff. And um, uh, eventually you'll be having test equipment for 2.1? Yes, because... Right now it's not 2.1 this one, right? Not, not right now. We, we like to develop a full spec um, unit. So we could develop part of the 2.1 spec now, but we want to, uh, since the 2.1 spec includes 8K, we want to wait until we can actually completely do or redo the hardware and provide full 8K eARC signal from our test equipment. Nice. And what do you, do you have here? So, like, if you have a source tester, we also need to test uh, as a, with a sync. And these are our protocol analyzers. We have a full model that does compliance testing, but this is our nice touchscreen handheld uh, analyzer. And it can analyze, generate, and we have tests like cable testing, sync testing, to make uh, testing easier for people. And like any good protocol analyzer, you can uh, copy EDIDs, upload anything. So instead of testing a ton of different displays, you can use this to mimic all your displays and test right on the equipment. The company in Japan? Uh, headquartered in Japan, and I'm part of the San Jose, California office to cover the US and Canada market. Is there r and in the US also, or is it just sales? Uh, just sales, but we are we take part in a lot of like standards conversation, and all of our engineers come visit us in San Jose anytime. And uh, you uh, you work with companies in uh, all over Asia, all, all over Korea, Asia, Japan, we are, everything yeah, China. In, in Japan, we are the ATC testing lab test equipment. So uh, all uh, companies all over Asia really trust our equipment, and we do have a presence in Europe and uh, the Americas as well.